Hi, it's time for another episode of It's Not About You. My name is Bob Benson. I pastor Christ Lutheran Church. Uh, we've been looking at different scriptures, proving to ourselves that even our salvation is not about us. It's about God bringing glory to himself and to his kingdom. Uh, this morning, I'd like to look at a section of scripture most of you are going to be familiar with. This starts in Luke 9, verse 23 through 27. And this is Jesus. And he said to all, if anyone would come after me, let him deny himself and take up his cross daily and follow me. For whoever would save his life will lose it, but whoever loses his life for my sake will save it. For what does it profit a man if he gains the whole world and loses or forfeits himself? For whoever is ashamed of me and of my words, of him will the Son of Man be ashamed. When he comes in his glory and the glory of the Father and of the holy angels. But I tell you truly, there are some standing here who will not taste death until they see the kingdom of God. This section of scripture, Jesus himself is laying out that we have to take up our cross daily. And, and the word there used for cross in the Hebrew is an interesting word. It means, uh, it means an instrument of sacrifice. Um, usually of capital punishment. Whoever would save his life will lose it, but whoever loses his life, we have to lose our life in service of Jesus Christ. We have to give up on our own interests and serve the interests of God. Uh, and that's what our life is all about, is being self-sacrificial. The word servant always used in the Bible, is an interesting word. If you really look at that word and you study it, it's someone who gives up on their own interests to serve the interests of others exclusively. And that's what we're called to do as Christians, to give up on our own desires, our own uh, needs, and actually start serving other people. Jesus himself said, if you see somebody that's thirsty and you offer them a drink of water, if you see somebody that's hungry and you feed them, those are the things that we're called to do for Christ. We're supposed to take care of others better than we take care of ourselves. Now, that doesn't mean that we don't take care of ourselves. Um, we care for other people in the same way that we care for ourselves. When we're hungry, what do we do? We go find something to eat. When we're thirsty, what do we do? We go find something to drink. That's what we're called to do for others around us. When we see that they're thirsty, we provide that drink for them. When we see that they're hungry, we provide that for them. We have a job to do, and that job is engaging in people's lives. And I would tell you that you've got to give up on yourself and serve other people. And that's what Luke 9 tells us. So for it's not about you, take the time today and make it about someone else. Thank you for taking your time to watch this morning.